Hello everyone, here is a question from stereochemistry. In testosterone, the number of chiral centers and stereo SMS respectively are how many? So, if a carbon atom has to be chiral, then it needs to have four different groups, isn't it? It should have four different groups attached to it. So, eliminate the ones that are not. We can eliminate sp2 carbons and also sp carbons. Here we do not have sp carbons, but we do have sp2 carbons in this structure. So, anytime you see carbon carbon double bond or carbonyl group, you should eliminate those. And also, if you see a triple bond, carbon carbon triple bond, you should eliminate those ones as well. So, we can definitely eliminate this one, this one, because here the hybridization is sp2, here also sp2, here also sp2. So, these three we can eliminate. We can also eliminate sp3 carbons where if it is a methyl group. So, if you have a methyl group, we should eliminate those because we have three hydrogens here. Even if it is a methylene group, we should eliminate because we have two hydrogens. So, even if we have two different units attached here, in total we have three different units, not four different units. So, therefore, methyl group and methylene groups we should eliminate. Therefore, let us eliminate all the methyl groups and methylene, methylene groups. So, CH2 here we can eliminate, this is also CH2 we can eliminate, CH2 let us eliminate those CH2 and then CH3 here CH2, CH2, CH3, CH2, CH2. So, now count how many carbon atoms are remaining those could be chiral 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Let us cross check it. We have an alcohol functional group here and then there is a hidden hydrogen. On this side we have CH2, on the other side we have quaternary carbon here 4 degree carbon and therefore this is indeed chiral. This carbon atom is indeed chiral. How about here? We have methyl group on one side, CH2 here, CH and then CHOH. Therefore, this is also chiral and here we have CH2, we have quaternary carbon and there is a hidden hydrogen and then CH here. Therefore, this is also chiral, four different groups. How about here? We have hidden hydrogen once again CH2 and then CH here, CH here. Now, this CH is different from this CH because when you go on this side, it is connected to CH2, CH2 that is part of a 5 member ring. But when you go on this side, it is connected to CH2, CH2, this CH is connected to CH2, CH2, but this is part of a 6 member ring, not 5 member ring. Therefore, there is asymmetry here. That means this is also chiral. How about here? We have a hidden hydrogen and then CH here, quaternary carbon, CH2. Therefore, this is also chiral. And then this one also, methyl group, CH2, sp2 carbon and then CH. Therefore, this is also chiral. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, 6 carbon atoms that are chiral and number of stereo isomers. Number of stereo isomer is 2 to the power n where n is the number of stereo centers. Here chiral centers and stereo centers are one and the same. So, this is equal to 2 to the power 6. 2 to the power 6 is 64. Therefore, option A is the correct choice here.